Greetings, ladies and gentlemen. Welcome back to the Steel Donut Collective. My name is Yellow. With me today, I have Bob. Hey, how's it going? And Connor. Hello there. And today, we're going to learn something new, because we're back on WikiHow, and yeah. we have here How to Act Like a Mermaid at School, suggested oh. to us by Eternal Flame. Thanks, buddy. Oh, man. And from oh, what man. I understand, this is actually a sort of well-known article, uh, but only in the sense that like it's well-known for being a really shitty article. Um, it's got three I, I and a guess, half stars, uh, and at time of recording, it's been it was updated twelve hours ago. So this version, we are yes. we are reading possibly the most up to date version of a wiki article we've ever covered. Yeah, <laughs> yeah, yeah. Oh, it's got one hundred forty six co authors though. Oh, Damn. oh man, it, it, uh, it I better, guess I'll need to add to it. It, yeah. it better be really well written then. You oh, know, yeah. everyone mocks this article, but it's really going to pay off once somebody's high school throws like a. Act like a mermaid competition, right? It'll be like it'll be like a you know sp school spirit kind of thing. You know the seniors have yeah. to be the seniors have to be you know trolls, and then yeah. the uh, the you know the the juniors have to be I don't know ogres, and then the 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 freshmen get to be mermaids. You know, yeah, and yeah. The, I guess yeah. the teachers would it would get to be I don't know dragons, or maybe everyone. You know, it, it's just a mermaid competition open to every oh, you know see. class. Maybe like but then the, the... one one aspiring freshman will read this article and master the, the art, art of acting, acting like a mermaid, like a mermaid, at, mermaid school. at school. And yes. it'll be like I don't know, freshman class will get all the points and win. Yeah, you know, and it'll be really inspiring. And those yeah. seniors will all look like, um... yeah, well, not not losers because the freshman class acted like mermaids. <laughs> but uh, they won't uh, win is the point yeah. <laughs> is that so All bad right. though well well let's anyway see. Let's yes see. let's, let's, see if let's it is. get into this so do you dream of deep water and splashing fins do you no, have the really. kind of voice no. that lures sailors to their doom hey there sailor them, you want make them jump doom? overboard but I have to be on the ship with them yeah are you happiest when you're swimming? Sure, I no. mean, I mean, I enjoy swimming. I'll be honest, but yeah. I, I, oh I, I'm God. happier at other points in time. And well, yellow once at one time went to school, right? Uh, mm. I did. Yes. Huh. You mm. think he acted like a mermaid there? <laughs> no. Let's oh. find out. Anyway, if you want to let your inner mermaid out at school, do so, do some research. Get the look. And act the part. And that is the wiki. How good. That's perfect. Goodbye. Thank you for watching. <laughs> Thanks for watching. Why do you have to act like a mermaid at school and not at the swimming pool? No, at because at school. <laughs> uh, yeah, you know, for acting like a mermaid in, in the swimming pool, there's a different article for that. I yeah. guess school is the one place that the readers of these articles will always end up being at. That's true. Because they're all children. Yeah. I'm insulting you. <laughs> <laughs> who are you insulting? The people who read this article. Oh, yes. Okay. Namely, Seriously. namely, specifically two named Yella and Bob. <laughs> yes. Yeah. We're children, yeah. Yella. Yes. Oh. All right. Oh, part I'm, one. Doing I'm, your I'm research. A I'm a 24 year old child. Yes. You know what? I yes. So am exactly. I. Almost yeah, 25. You sit around even. all day. Playing the video games. Yeah. Okay. That hits surprisingly and... close to home. Let's move on. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> Doing your research. It's... Part that one. Yes. Is, is a very derpy looking blonde mermaid and then a ghost. You no, think no. that's like a just ghost one maid. mermaid? Or a mermaid. Yeah, one mermaid and it's like that she released her dark side. It's uh, it's her it's her dark yes, it's it's her shadow half. Like I can tell you what she's saying right there. She's saying, damn. <laughs> she does have that right. face, yes. Yeah. yeah. But her it, wrists, ugh. Anyway, Number one, yes. decide what kind of mermaid you are. There are all kinds of mermaids in folklore. There are all kinds of mermaids in folklore and fairy tales, and their nature can range from tragically romantic to murderous. That are you the correct. kind of mermaid that falls in love with sailors or the kind that tries to drown them? Are. <laughs> Are fish your best friends or a floating feast? Get your story straight ahead of time. <laughs> getting your story straight ahead of time will make it much simpler for you to practice your role and helps in getting people to take you seriously. 
People will not take you seriously. seriously? They'll take you pretty seriously when you snap out of your uh, your daydream and you're giving someone a swirly in the school bathroom. Right. No. That, hey no. there, sailor. <laughs> See anything interesting down there? Call me a mermaid. <laughs> <laughs> Drown me, <laughs> <a> mermaid. <laughs> <laughs> can I can I just say it's uh it's it's nice. I I think I. They say there are lots of kinds of mermaids, so that kind of opens things up. I'm going to be a yeah. mermaid at school. Uh, the kind of mermaid I'm going to be is going to be very easy for me to be because, one, they really exist. Uh, two, I already look like one. I'm going to be a manatee. Uh, oh, yeah. Oh. Yeah. A sea cow. Perfect. Uh, yeah. Come. Number two, read up about mermaids. Start with the ancient myths about mermaids. Mermaid right. myths pop up all over the world from Russia to Greece. That's not all and... over the world. Right. Okay. Like just okay. Europe and Asia. Okay. It, yeah. Like I was, I was about to say, picture a map of the world and then draw a line from Europe to Greece. That you leaves out yes. the all the Americas. That leaves out all the Americas. It leaves out most of Europe, most of Asia. In fact, that is actually very small. It leaves out all Can, of Africa. Yeah, that too. <laughs> oh, by the, by the way, I know we didn't we didn't say anything about the picture, but I, I just want to point out that it, it looks like they were trying to write the word mermaids, if and I, somehow I, okay, they wrote M E R E and then went oh fuck. Actually, <laughs> I'll I'll be honest. I kind like I read the M to me looks more like an H, and the R right. looks more like a, v. Looks like a v. Yeah, heave. He, that's that's actually he my he favorite been, book. He that's been, my favorite book. Heave. Heave. <laughs> Alright. Then move on to the realms of mermaid fiction. Oh, as opposed oh. to mermaid fact. Yeah, you know, <laughs> as opposed to those ancient myths, which are all factual. Which are yeah. all true, yeah. No one's ever written anything down that has been fictional. Until modern times. <laughs> yeah. Hans Christian Andersen's The Little Mermaid is widely considered to be the definitive mermaid tale. Sure. I think a lot of people will argue with you, with you over that, but okay. Yeah. Besides Anderson, take a look at Oscar Wilde's The Fisherman and His Soul. Another great H- story. H.P. Lovecraft's The Shadow Over Innsmouth. I have a thing to say about this, but we'll save it. <laughs> Donna Joe Napoli's Sirena and Alice Hoffman's Aquamarine. Excellent, excellent stories to be sure. Uh, the Shadow Over Innsmouth, uh, not exactly a mermaid, more like humans fucking fish creatures. And, and making more like, horrible you hybrid don't want monsters. to start acting like that at high school. Like, if you start acting like a horrible <laughs> fucking fish creature, uh, you're not gonna wow anybody. You, you <laughs> might actually scare them. I well, mean, like, you know, unless you want to, like, <laughs> all the I time mean, and hey, have gills like step, and, like, like webbed fingers. One. Dude, like step one said, you need to decide what kind of mermaid you are. Like, if you if, want to be a mermaid, like that a mermaid is a means horrible that you have to be fish creature. So- I mean, if you have to be constantly soaking wet and, like, <laughs> being all weird, then no, I don't think anybody wants to be like that. Don't look to H.P. Lovecraft for hey, inspiration. Hey, don't, don't, tell, don't tell people what they don't and don't, what they do and don't want. H.P. Lovecraft, <laughs> in that story, the fish people weren't the good guys. No, they were the bad guys. Well, I mean, like they said, maybe you want to be a mermaid that drowns people. Maybe you want to be a horrible fish person that kills people. You know? Yeah, yeah, yeah. Okay. You know, yeah. People don't necessarily yeah. want to be the good thing. When I you guess. want to buck society's trends, but you also want to act like a mermaid. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, rebel. Which I without... guess you're already doing the first one by doing the second. Rebel without his lungs. Uh, You're ridiculous, yeah. Step, right. step three, step and th- before we go there, yeah. can we yeah. just point out this beautiful discount ar- aerial? Like, yeah, this right here, this is uh, a yeah. discount waifu right here. <laughs> yeah, yeah. <laughs> of Ariel. You want a mermaid uh, mermaid girlfriend? No belly button needed, no lips needed, no ex- <laughs> <laughs> just a no look teeth. of shock on her face. <laughs> Beautiful singing voice, completely beautiful. Yeah, I've heard it shatters glass within a hundred foot radius. Yeah, it, I mean, you see, you see how there's like a square of light around her, and then just darkness everywhere else. Yeah, yeah. This is her. That, that's the power of the darkness. That's, that's her... the world dying past a five foot radius. Yeah, <laughs> the power of her voice. She's holding it off. 
Step 3. Watch movies and TV shows about mermaids. Begin with Disney's version of The Little Mermaid. It's the most famous version of the Anderson story, and you'll have to be familiar with it if you want to be accepted as a mermaid. Wait, so you think that there's a possibility that people are going to believe you're a mermaid but not accept you? Yeah, kind of. It you think there's like... mermaid? Bi- you think your biggest hurdle here in acting like a mermaid at school is mermaid bigotry? <laughs> it sounds like this article is going. You can be any type of mermaid you want to be, as long as you're like the one from Little Mermaid. Right. <laughs> mm. Anyway, Splash is a live-action film that shows the trials of turning into a mermaid every time you get wet, making it a good how-to guide. But uh, is it a good movie? That I don't want to sit down. Say. I don't want to have to sit down and watch some stupid movies. Like, wasn't Splash some Disney, you know, straight to TV movie type thing? One of those live-action crap that I, they I, pumped I, out. I don't know. You know, I have no. I don't idea. know. Aquamarine is another good choice. I'll take your word for it, I guess. Consider checking out Mr. Peabody and the Mermaid, Peter Pan, Pirates of the Caribbean on Stranger Tides, and She Creature. Oh, okay. Oh, yeah. Why not just search up Creature of the Black Lagoon if we're just going to get into all kinds of weird fish monsters? Mermaids are less common on television, but the Australian series H2O Just Add Water provides wow. a look at three young mermaids in high school trying to keep their magical powers secret. First of all, that sounds like an awful show. Second I feel like of that all, was also on the Disney Channel. Second of all, I really want to edit this to be the 147th author on here just so that I can add, also watch Halloween H2O for some inspiration. <laughs> <laughs> you can be just like Jason Voorhees. Oh, boy. Yeah. Oh, that concludes doing the research. Yeah. yeah. After you've so watched onto... those movies or TV shows or whatever, you're done. Well, no. Then <laughs> comes part two. Looking the part. Yeah. Oh, I mean, and look I see at they that. also changed, they changed uh, artists, I think. Eh, somewhat. We, yeah, yeah. They, decided they needed to go someone for who could animu. actually draw people. Yeah, so, someone yeah. who could draw a little bit of animu. <laughs> yeah. Yeah. Well, I mean, Ariel is looking pretty Animu up there, but... You think? I thought in <laughs> Animu they had eyes. And, and like, lips? Not, well, you know what? She's more fish than human in, in this yeah. version oh, of her, because yeah, she's because got fish fi- eyes. And fish don't have lips. That's true! <laughs> and, again, fish all, and fish don't have belly buttons, either. Oh, shit. Oh. We figured it out. Oh, I guess it was an extremely accurate look. <laughs> being a, being a Str- strange, how, strange how that works out. Yeah. yeah. So step one of part two: mm. grow your hair long. Mermaids are famous for their long, beautiful tresses. Mm. Consider adding hair extensions as well. Oh, they're famous for their hair extensions. <laughs> <laughs> they're also famous for their highlights. <laughs> extensions come in all colors and adding a dramatic streak of blue or purple to your hair will give you the proper otherworldly look see what I mean I, I suppose yeah. yeah you can be any type of mermaid you want you can be a, a scene stir mermaid <laughs> <laughs> you could also be however yeah, you could also be what? a damn mermaid damn <laughs> if you get like streaks of red in your yeah. mermaid hair in, in your black your jet black yeah. hair yeah 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 yeah, then you could just go cosplay as Shadow if Shadow you get the bored mermaid. of the mermaid thing. Shadow, yeah. Shadow the Shadow mer- the Merhog. I was about to go <laughs> cosplay <laughs> as Shadow the Merhog from the Chuckinators say, one story. It, oh, no. no. Let's oh, not. God. That, that's a rabbit hole I don't want to revisit. <laughs> yeah. Um, however, make sure you aren't going against the school dress code when dyeing your hair. Oh, wow. right. This is for being a mermaid at school. I right. forgot. Not yeah, at the library, yeah. not at home, not while you're taking a shit. It's about being at school. Okay. Yeah. Take good care of your hair by washing it at least three to four times a week. <laughs> is that take considered good? Take good care good? of your hygiene by showering once a day. Jeez. Yeah, yeah, like is that considered good hygiene for long hair? I I don't. I honestly don't Was know. It, is it acceptable for half your showers to be like you just turn it on, jump in, wash your body, then jump out? Yeah, like stick your I, head out the the thing. I like mean, I, I, I mean, thought most people I, washed their hair pretty regularly. I mean, I'll be honest. I shower twice a week. Wow. Oh. Yeah. 
Well, I think we're done here. Yeah. Thanks for watching. I think we've got, yeah, that's, um... Uh, I know, like, what? what? It's remind not like me to I, never room with you? Dude, it's not yeah. like I don't wash myself the other days. I just only shower twice a week. Well, do you wash your hair, though? No. It doesn't need to be washed every day. Are you crazy? You'll destroy your hair. I... I disagree. Then you disagree. I, mean, it's I don't not see the point of what I don't see the point of washing your hair when you're day. already bathing or showering to just like lower your head and run your hair under the water or yeah. you know dip it in the water. I think some I think people just go way overboard with with all of showering and washing personally. This is this is official. It is now official. I am not the dirtiest member of the Steel Donut. We have <laughs> evidence. Yes. yes. Wow. This is concrete proof. Sure. I um, showed you, Mom. Moving on. <laughs> Brush it every morning and night, for mermaids love brushing their hair. Oh. See, okay. you can be anything you want to be, but you've got to follow these stereotypes. <laughs> yeah. Plus, it's good for your scalp and causes your hair to become healthier. Well, brushing yeah. that much isn't going to be good for your hair. I mean, <laughs> much like an RPG stat, if you work <laughs> at it a lot, it'll get better. You know, yeah, your numbers, grind. numbers will yeah. just go up. Mm-hmm. Min maxing your hair. <laughs> Min maxing your hair. <laughs> yeah. If your hair isn't already silky, try using a different shampoo type to get those desired results. Mm. Also, conditioner can help soften and strengthen your hair if you use the right amount. Okay, so remind me. Okay, so supposedly mermaids have to have this this really flowy, silky hair. Right. Salt water. Yeah. <laughs> Isn't good for hair, right? Well, it's not good for hair if you're not a mermaid. Oh. But, but if you're a mermaid, right. you know. And I like that they specifically say, if your hair's not silky, you do all this stuff. Because that that's... Uh, you, you know, know, you can be whatever That really only applies to white people. I you, mean, you, you can... You know, well, like you everybody be, else has different you, kinds of hair. You can be any type of mermaid you want to be, as long as you have silky smooth hair. Right, like if I have yeah. frizzy hair because that's yeah. just what I have, then you're, yeah. this article is telling me that I have to want to do something else. Yeah, yeah. 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 How L'Oreal. dare you think you're beautiful the way you are? Change <laughs> yourself to be be a mermaid at school, L'Oreal, because you're a mermaid at school and also <laughs> worth it. Yeah, but L'Oreal, because you're worthless. <laughs> <laughs> oh, yeah. you're worthless as a mermaid at school if you don't have silky hair. Yeah, Ouch. exactly. Ouch. Yeah. Um, try purchasing tropical scented shampoos and conditioners that will instantly remind people of the sea. Okay. You can also just throw salt water in their faces. Yeah, <laughs> yeah. just carry around some cups. By of the condition. by, the ocean breeze. <laughs> scent of every soap and conditioner and whatever. Yeah, I fully, I fully use. transitioned from using dra- uh, deodorant, and now I am just using Febreze Ocean Breeze. <laughs> <laughs> I just spray it all yeah. over myself, and I'm good to go. Yeah, Perfect. at the deodorant aisle, it's all you know, it's all forest scents and manly shit. You know, fuck forest that. Scents Febreze and manly is where shit. it's at. Yeah, yeah. Number two, accessorize. Start with some hair clips in the shape of sea creatures. Starfish, dolphins, fish, and seahorses are all very popular. Look are for they? Necla- I mean, relative to other sea creatures, I mean, does it, have you ever seen a hair clip that's in the shape of a sea cucumber? Or have a I ever fish? seen a hair clip in the shape of a starfish? I mean, yeah. a starfish. I have. Okay. I mean... I, I, hmm. Yeah, I mean, that's, are that's, not very un- that's not very uncommon. I don't know. I don't think like I've ever weird... seen one in the shape of just a fish. <laughs> yeah. I mean, maybe a fish is a little bit weird. Or maybe, I guess, a, not a realistic looking fish. No, usually but it's like, like if you had like an anatomically correct sea cucumber holding your hair together, that might be <laughs> that a little would weird. That would be really weird. Look for necklaces, earrings, bracelets, and brooches with the same shapes. Little by little, you should convert your entire body into accessories. Yes. Start with a hair clip, then get some necklace, then some earrings, bracelets, brooches, you know, uh, toe rings. An- uh, yeah, uh, an- you know, you know those an- like anklet things. Like, yeah, those things. Uh, swap your pants out for just uh, you know, you know just obviously yeah. a fishtail. Um, you know, kind of, kind of, or you know, kind of go like how uh, like how in um, 
in like uh, certain countries you know you you have like uh, these these dancers that have like all these jingly things yeah, yeah. all over that but just do that but everything of course everything Dude. has to be ocean themed right and yeah, then at a certain like point ocean. start surgically removing parts of your body and replacing them with more accessories until one day <laughs> your friends look at you and go Melissa you look like you're just a big pile of <gasps> oh my god you're a mermaid <laughs> yes yeah. uh if you cannot find anything appropriate in local stores, a simple shell necklace is easy to find and will give the same effect. You just said if I can't find anything. If Where would I find a shell necklace find... if I was looking for it and I couldn't if you can't find, find it? find something, then just get it. Yeah. Come on. It's not hard. Just make Amazon. Sure... I don't know. Make sure to always wear it over your clothing and not hide it underneath your shirt so people can easily see it. Hmm. Yeah. Try to purchase a shell necklace that looks or is authentic. If this is impossible, how? Okay. Go to the beach and find a small shell that you. Oh, wait. So it's harder. You're suggesting it might be harder <laughs> for me to go online and buy a, a shell necklace than it would be for me to go to the beach? What about everybody it, who doesn't live near the beach? If you can't find a necklace in stores nearby, then just simply go Fly to the beach. Fly to Florida and, do it and get one yeah. from the beach. <laughs> Sometimes there are small holes in the shells, usually found in the smaller shells, that is big enough to let a chain through, but small enough to, so that it doesn't crack the shell. Don't wear the shell necklace when you go to sleep, or you might accidentally crack it in your sleep. Take it off before bedtime and showering so that you will preserve it well. Yeah, well, yeah, obviously, this is about <sighs> being a mermaid at school, not, you know, at home. In bed, being a mermaid or anywhere under else. the shower. Or right. anywhere else. Last yeah. period rolls around and you get home and you just ditch all this mermaid shit. And finally start Cause... putting on your unicorn shit. <laughs> yeah, yeah. How, and then you hit, yeah, how to pretend to be a unicorn at home. Right? At home. Step three of looking the part wear ocean colors. Bright blues and greens are associated with the ocean, as well as anything turquoise or aqua. Mm. You already said blue. Yeah. You don't have to stick to just those colors, though. A flash of purple or orange will give your outfit a tropical look. Look yeah, at pictures fuck of it. ocean Just life. go buy those shirts that have, like, a ton of fish <laughs> on them. <laughs> and try All right, to so we got some of those vivid colors Violet, indigo, powers. blue, green, yellow, orange, red. Okay, so violet is there, indigo's there, blue's there, green's there, not yellow, orange, no red. So that's two of, of the rainbow colors not in. So basically, yeah, just wear clothes. Wear but what if you're wearing wear bright a, a colors. picture of a rainbow fish? Uh, right. Uh, yeah. Yeah, you just don't. You just don't. Yeah. Avoid wearing mermaid costumes to school, because people will either think you're trying too hard, uh, or they won't take you seriously. Oh, God forbid. Oh. You gotta only go half seas on the whole looking like a mermaid at school thing. Yeah. yeah. However, do wear a mermaid costume if you go trick-or-treating on Halloween night. But don't overdo the look. How? Wait, well, it's what? Halloween. It comes around once a year. Who cares I think that would be the one the time look? you get to overdo the look. Yeah. 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 I mean, well, actually, no, on Halloween you should dress as something other than a mermaid. Because a mermaid wouldn't want to dress as themselves oh, yeah. for Halloween. Well, maybe well, I if, mean, maybe th if then you're not at on school, a school though. day. You're not at that's school. Halloween's on a school day, and and they have a Halloween party. Well, I mean that's then not. You get, go but all that's out not, on the mermaid. But that's not trick or treating, so you know. But I mean, still, like, you do wear a Halloween costume if you go trick or treating on Halloween night. Let's let's be honest. There's probably not a lot of schools doing trick or treating at night on Halloween. Uh, but 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 still, it still doesn't make sense to me why you would dress up as a mermaid on Halloween if. Like, I would think that a mermaid would want to dress as something other than what they are during the day. You know? I don't know. I don't, like, I, I don't know any mermaids. I might go on Halloween as a vampire. I'm not going to go as a vampire if I'm already a vampire. No, then you're going to go for irony and go as a vampire hunter. Yeah. Or, like, I could go on Halloween for irony. I could go as, like, a white person or clean. <laughs> <laughs> or employed. Wow. Oh, nice. that's a good one. That's good. Yeah, oh, man. Yeah. I want to dress right. as an employed person. Yeah. Step four. Paint your nails in ocean colors. Oh, so do the same thing as clothing. 
Like, yeah, except uh, one of those nails. is pink. Mm. Blues, greens, and purples will match your clothes and draw people's attention when you comb your fingers through your long hair. Wow. Okay. Seriously, why is one of those pink? They didn't even mention that. Eh. Like green, uh, greenish blue, greenish blue, greenish blue, pink, greenish blue. I think the person who made the picture just ran, uh, you know, just ran out of greenish blue. I guess. Yeah, <laughs> yeah their paint tool stopped working. Also. Yeah, yeah. It's 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 really annoying how that. I, I have a few artist friends. They and were going they always like, complain about that. It's terrible. They were working Stupid their way tablets. in from the ends. Mm-hmm. Yeah. The one time I didn't want you to change colors. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. Oh, and this next one. I guess cake your makeup on like a fucking clown. Yeah. I mean that's it's it's not that bad, honestly. After I guess it's not it but... to your lips, run it through your hair as well. Yeah. And <laughs> I also like her eyes are just like freaking me out. Yeah, but that's yeah. because the pupil is kinda slit like. It, it's slit like and it's, it's also like... like instead of being a hole, it's more like a pit. Yeah, um, yeah, it's not really a solid color. Oh god, point, so she it just sta- goes further and further back. She stared into the abyss, and the yes. abyss stared back. You know what? I know what those are. Those are dead fish eyes. Oh, oh, yeah. oh, oh! She's really good. She's really good at this. Mm. Yeah. Step five: coordinate your makeup. A subtle, as opposed to all you. those people not trying to be mermaids who just slap shit on randomly. <laughs> yeah. You know, blue. I just open up my makeup kit and slam my face into it. You know, and go, you know, okay, I'm know, ready for school. You know, nice red eye shadow on the one eye and nice black eye shadow on the other. Perfect. Right. I mean, paint, I slammed my head li- down so hard that I don't even need eye shadow. I already paint, have a black eye. Paint the lips like electric blue or something. Perfect yeah. combination. Yeah. I have rouge sudden- covering my chin. <laughs> <laughs> a subtle blue tint on your lips or in the outer corner of your eye will accentuate your outfit. It might also make you look like you died. <laughs> <laughs> hey, girl. T- you look like you've been dead for a few days. You smell hey. like it, too. Hey, you look, <laughs> yeah. hey, you yeah, look you like a walking corpse. <laughs> you haven't, you haven't oh, showered you're your trying to be two a, days. Oh, you're trying to be a mermaid? I thought you were trying to be an undead. Oh, yeah, girl. Who killed Laura Palmer? <laughs> Try to avoid sparkly shades and glitter that could draw too much attention and make you look like you're trying too hard. Again with this, oh, you're not. don't look like you're trying too hard. Yeah, you want yeah. to you want to be different, but you don't want to be too different. Yeah, yeah. it is you know, school after all. Yeah, people. Will yeah, you don't want to get made fun of. These are the most important years of your life. Right. And nothing. Le- and nothing after this is going to matter at all. If people yeah. make fun of you for trying to be a mermaid at school. Your life is over. And it's I mean, over. No, yeah. no, wait, no, wait, actually, your life is forfeit. Oh, yeah. There oh. we go. Damn. Damn. Mermaids sometimes are shy and don't like to draw attention to themselves, except when they're singing, trying to but lure in sailors and drown them. You don't them. have to be a shy mermaid. And also, <laughs> uh, you, you're, uh, you're trying to tip people off that you're a mermaid, so uh, you're not that shy. No. No, no, I mean, no. honestly, if you were trying to keep it a secret, you wouldn't it be easier if you just stayed the way you were? Yeah, you know the you know. People I mean, ne- when I people, walk around, I've never, never s- looked at another person and thought oh, that person could be a mermaid, and that's because none of them are ever trying to tell me that. I mean, unless they are, and I'm just bad at reading it, or they're bad at indicating. Maybe, it. maybe. I mean, I know I'm not the best at reading people, so I might probably, I would probably miss out on that. Yeah. The subtle signs. Yeah. yeah, they have a shirt that just says "I'm a fucking mermaid," and, <laughs> and he just, just plays like, right over it. Yeah, I'm just it's, like, oh, this is a fucking you know, something. Now. That's that's you know that's one that's one perk. Of 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 the way we are, though, you know, we treat everyone the same. We see everyone the same because we're looking down at their shoes the whole time. Right. That's that's yeah. one yeah. of the great things about being yeah. social. We don't, awkward. you know, we don't. See colors, no one could ever you know? call you a bigot or racist or or any yeah. of that because you're so busy looking at their shoes, you have no idea what they look like. We don't see colors except for the color of their shoes. Yeah. When we go, man, why did I wear tennis shoes to the? You're looking down. You're like, oh my god, they're wearing such cool converses. Fuck. <laughs> yeah. Damn, Daniel, rocking the white vans again. 
<laughs> yeah. Damn. Anyway, what, Damn. What, once we have the lockdown, it's yes. it's yeah. down to the behavior in part yes. three. This act, act like a mermaid. Yes. Number one, yeah. act alert when people talk about the ocean. Can when we the just, subject? Can we oh, just you want to see like, this picture? picture? Yeah. Yeah. She's looking. Look at, at, lo- look at that dreamscape clownfish. Like, oh, I thought you were gonna say clown face. Oh, oh. <laughs> but yeah. no, I see the clown. Yeah, that that clownfish is. I mean, that is one sexy clownfish. Let's be honest. <laughs> yeah, uh, and I can see her. She's in her watery prison, going, "My God, that yeah. fish! It's so free." Oh God, that <laughs> fish! It's lunch. <laughs> yeah, <laughs> the fish is flying through the air, just minding its own business, and she's like. How did this happen? Woe is me. <laughs> I stared into the abyss, and this is what happened. Yeah, Fuck. the abyss stared back into me. Oh. The, the abyss turned into a clownfish and swam away. She genuinely doesn't look curious about the fish. She looks, like, sad and, like, scared. Yeah, sad and, like, yeah. yeah. Also, Melancholy, her hand, like, oh. holy shit, I was about to comment that her hand is kind of big, but her wrist... Whoa! <laughs> No, her yeah, hand. It looks her like, wrist is looks wider like, than her hand. It dude, looks she, like the hand is just grafted onto her shoulder. I was about to say oh. that. Yes. Christ, that hand is still <laughs> fucking huge. I mean, yeah. a single hand covering her entire face. Like, I don't know. Perspective. Act alert when people talk about the ocean. When the subject of underwater life in the ocean comes up in class, act interested but informed, as if you are al- you are already an expert. Talk a little about fish, currents, and tidal waves. If your classroom has an aquarium, take it as an opportunity. Take it as an uh, blah, Take it as an opportunity to be either mesmerized or insulted. How dare these lowly yeah. humans imprison my people! You know Let what else? You the know, fish run free. You know what? You, <laughs> and you just you know what grab else? the <laughs> aquarium and you just throw it on the ground. Yeah, throw it out. Uh, yeah. You could also like when no one's looking, dunk your head in the water and just go like, "Ah, oh, I'm back in my home." <laughs> yeah. <laughs> or just like just take a little bit of a a little sip of the water and mm, mm, tastes mm. like home. Yeah. Be ready to point out when others are mistaken, but don't make a nuisance of yourself. You don't are trying be to like, be a mermaid. You are trying to be a mermaid, not some kind of, you know, know-it-all. Yeah. 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 I guess having to learn all about marine biology and whatever to pull this off is a little better than that other one, you know, how to act like you're immortal. Right. Where you had to go yeah. learn dead languages to keep up the act. I mean, at the very <laughs> least, you're learning something that you could, in theory, turn into, like, a useful you know, yeah. skill. Yeah, that, yeah, that you know, something that you could turn into a career as a yeah. marine biologist. I mean, being a marine biologist would be the an incredibly ironic and you you know, it would For be a, a very mermaid, comic yes. booky slash TV show uh, worthy, uh, you know, alibi for being so into fish. Huh. Oh. All right. Um, number two. Number two. Be very afraid of people. Did got... they just trace this from k <laughs> I feel like they did. I feel like I've seen a screen. I mean, they've, they, 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 they might have very well not... traced it from something. Like, I don't know. Yeah. I think I it's interesting care. that the, the person in the foreground is an elf. Mm. Yeah, <laughs> I mean, look at that color scheme. long hair. Yeah, yeah, I mean, that seems maybe, like an elf that... to me. Maybe and, that person's just try acting like an elf at school. Oh, yeah, they, and they, her shock isn't. Oh my god, they're talking about mermaids. It's. Oh my fuck! There's an actual elf here. I gotta step <laughs> up my game. Yeah. <laughs> step two: change the subject when people talk about mermaids. A true mermaid would not be likely to enjoy having the secrets of her people discussed in public. Yeah, probably. I would think. Your silence on the subject will make people all the more intrigued. Um, totally. That's or, totally or, how it works. Or maybe they just think you don't care about that stuff at all. Oh, you, you yeah. know, like, I'm like, hey, Connor, you know, uh, how's, uh, so I, I watched, uh, I watched this, this movie, uh, The Little Mermaid, just the other day, and I was thinking about mermaids, and Connor just goes, I don't want to talk about it. And I'll go, yeah. Okay. And that's where that ends. Silent. Don't you see how silent I am? 
I, I see that you're silent. It's actually don't, kind of pissing me off. Don't you see me suffering in silence? Yeah. 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 Um, although you might want to drop a subtle hint along the lines of, the Little Mermaid got it all wrong. Wow, that's not um, subtle. Oh, oh, I thought I, I thought you were trying to be, you know, I thought you were taking that as your source material, but now it's all wrong? What? Yeah. I was down with mermaids before the Little Mermaid ruined it all. <laughs> oh, wait, I don't want to talk about mermaids. Um, <laughs> shit. This is, nearly, um, this is nearly as not subtle as that tip from uh, How to Be Immortal, which was like, uh, you know, oh, you know, you, I remember how Wolfgang used to be. Like, no, <laughs> this isn't subtle at all. You know what? I get the feeling that maybe there is some author crossover happening here. Like, oh. You know, with with over a hundred authors, that might as well be the case. Yeah. Yeah. Anyway, be deathly afraid, except don't really use your arm to block the water. No, actually, yeah. this is her casting the water, and she's oh. now finishing the motion. Oh, she, yeah. oh, she's yeah. using Through it awkward. Oh, dude, she's using an aqua spell. Yeah, exactly. Yeah. This is her saying, like, go! And, like, <sighs> casting the water. Step three. Huh. Act alert around water. You don't have to run through the hallway screaming. Yeah, I mean, please don't. No, don't, don't do that. That's not... You see not. the water fountain and you just have a mental breakdown. Oh, yeah. shit. I've had those. That's not fun. Don't do that if you can help it. You can't, probably can't, but that's a different th different thing entirely. Anyway, but it doesn't hurt to act a little nervous and quickly dry yourself off. If you're not walking around with a mermaid tail 24-7, then you are most likely a mermaid that transforms at the touch of water. Yeah, probably. Sure. That makes sense. It makes sense. Oh, see, it does. It makes sense for you to avoid transforming at school and acting the part will make it more real. What? <laughs> I mean, sure. I think that's that goes without saying. I There's so many assumptions going on. I here. know, I think it's mm. it's perfectly clear. And I think uh, <laughs> oh, yeah. 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 Clear yeah. as crystal. Yeah. If you have to come into contact with water, wear a special charm on your necklace or in your hair that you never remove. And drop <gasps> hints about how it prevents you from transforming without saying it outright. <laughs> wow. Yeah. Yeah. Hey, Connor, I just, did I, I ever tell you that if I take off my ring, I'll transmorph? <laughs> uh, oh. Hey, 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 Bob. What's hey, up? Bob. Hey, Bob. Hey, hey, Bob. What's hey, Bob. Hey, Bob. What's up? <laughs> Do you, you see this? You see this cool ring? Uh huh. You see this cool ring yeah. I got? You, you want to know about this ring? I mean, I've seen you wear this you, ring all the time. Yeah. What, what? Yeah, yeah. You want to? You want to? You want to? Sure. Wanna, yeah, you want to? You want to know about this ring? Oh, <laughs> well. I mean, uh, you know, it uh, prevents me from uh, changing. We'll just say, you know, into uh, well, <laughs> I mean, that's for me to know and you to uh, uh, to not know. Oh, <laughs> oh. Uh, I don't want to talk about it. Okay. Okay. <laughs> It's uh, very subtle. <laughs> yeah. I have yeah. a feeling this guy might be yeah, a you werewolf. Yeah, people on until you want to play the subject and then you go dead silent. <laughs> Hang on, didn't we do... Didn't we do how to act like a werewolf as well? Yeah. Uh, well, yeah. We're just covering all the bases. Basics. Yeah, just bases. Be, be everything. It's weird, like, now that I'm thinking about it, except for, like, how to convince people you're not rich, we've done quite a few of these that are just, like, dispelling stupid superstitions. <laughs> well, that that's usually some of the dumber articles on WikiHow. Stupid stitions, mm. as they're called. Because if it had stitions. any basis in the real world, it would be how to do something you can actually do, <laughs> and not how to make up. Well, I mean, don't we don't we unofficially have the series how to lie to people? Yeah, that's true. And so this um, is just another entry in that. Yeah, it may help if your charm is sterling silver. This will be explained. Oh, later. of course. Because werewolves are allergic to sterling silver. Yeah, we're so no, dumb. No, That's Bob, Bob, we this is the mermaid article. Yeah, isn't that what I said? No. What did I say? Uh, not important. Okay. If no, if no one notices your nervousness at the touch of water, don't worry. 
gradually they will probably will start to notice it and probably and, not and, no and if they do they might think you're just aquaphobic yeah however if you add more drama to it people will think you're a drama queen and or trying to get attention and or oh maybe god aquapho- forbid and or, they ma- think- and or maybe aquaphobic well, God forbid they think that you're trying to get attention. You are trying to be a fucking mermaid. <laughs> yeah. Try to get their attention, but not too much attention. You don't want to be the laughing stock. Otherwise, your life is over. You'll be ruined. Then what'll Man, you do? You'll have life no one. Is forfeit. Man, trying to completely, completely act like something you're not at high school is so hard. You hmm. know. <laughs> Maybe I should just. Be myself and not. Try That's to ridiculous, act like a Connor. It's, being you're yourself right. will what only get thinking? you killed. Being, what am I thinking? being yourself will. Wait, will, what? Dude, socially you, killed. Socially killed. Wanna, yes. If you wanna, just like it was actually. If you want to act, yeah. if you want to act like yourself, yeah. you might as well forfeit your life right now. Yeah. Dehumanize yourself and face to bloodshed. <laughs> Dehumanize yourself and face to high school. <laughs> Step Is four. This mine. Yes. Uh, yeah. And I'm looking at right. this picture, and the first thing I'm noticing is that her, I guess, okay, so we saw her right hand is fused to her shoulder and yes. massive. And her left hand, mm-hmm. it looks like, is pretty scrawny. It's also coming in a really weird angle. Like, like, try to act that out. You have to bring your elbow up, like, above your shoulder to do that. I mean, yeah. that's not that hard Ow. to do. I know, but it doesn't feel natural. It doesn't feel comfortable. No, usually like, you have is she slightly supposed to be lower, cr- just holding true. her head because, like, she's got to do the fucking chicken wing to do that. <laughs> I don't want to be a chicken. I don't want to be a duck. I want to be a mermaid. Ah, oh, only one this worked. Four. Step four. Practice your singing. Mermaids are known for their beautiful voices. If your voice is naturally good, show it off when you're listening to the car radio or hanging out in the choir room. Oh, yeah. (laughs) If not, get some lessons in private, and in the meantime, let others know that you're afraid to sing in public and let them draw their own conclusions as to why. What do you mean? There's like a hundred other reasons other than you being a fucking mermaid. You're a mermaid. Most, most, most Most probable thing, they might think you don't think you're that good at singing. And you're probably right. Yeah. And whether or not you are is not even the point. Yeah, That's... there are a hundred other reasons they'll think of before they think you're a mermaid. <laughs> I, I don't want to say... I didn't even you know, remember I, I... that singing was a thing mermaids did until we got to this point in the article. I, I don't I don't like singing in public because I'm afraid that my voice will hypnotize the masses. I mean, um, uh, I just don't think I'm a very uh, good singer. Uh, <laughs> it's like, yeah, uh, you're worried that you're too good. <laughs> Well, I mean, that's what that's what mermaids do. They're like sirens. Yeah, I mean, you are making s- sailors drown in the yeah, urinal. Mm. Yeah. As an um, a- yeah. Avoid singing too much, or people will think you're only trying to show others how good you are. Duh. Then they'll, s- <laughs> then they'll start to ignore, avoid, and slash or dislike you. Um, or you know, they like you because you can sing well. I no, they're gonna. Dis- w- they're I not would, going I to would, like you. I would appreciate a friend. They're who gonna disown you. Well singing has well. Been well, you banned. would until they continue to do it for the rest of their fucking life. Singing. You're just and trying dancing. to hang out, and they're singing, and you're like, okay, well, I'm trying to have a conversation. Singing and dancing. <laughs> they're singing their p- this high school. Dude, they're, they're singing their half of the conversation. Yes, that's the worst. What if he was? What if they were growling their part of the conversation? Mm. <laughs> <laughs> I'm pretty sure I what cannot think of a sentence noise? in which to use that sound. <laughs> what was that noise? It's from Disturbed. Oh, oh. <laughs> 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 da, 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 yeah. No, maybe you, like you 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 step on a tack or like you stub your toe. Call me weird, but I prefer when people just speak. Yeah. Um, if worse comes to worse and you still can't develop your singing talent, don't worry. You don't have to sing to be a mermaid. Just avoid singing and don't tell anyone about your voice. Uh, I'm pretty sure that's not the phrase. Worst comes to worst. I they're relaxing the standards more and more. How I could be a mermaid by this point. You know? 
Well, I mean, I uh, I just uh, I'm temporarily long hairless as I got a haircut. Okay, <laughs> and uh, mm. um, I uh, I, I, I don't speak to me about my voice. Okay, or anything else, or the ocean, or mermaids. I'm a mermaid that likes all colors. Um, I like long swims at the beach. And and doesn't like, go swimming. I like long swims. The- <laughs> yeah. <laughs> yeah, yeah. God damn it. Um. All right. Look at this uh, next one. Oh, it's, that's a very kill, small bird. Kill a bird, I guess. I mean, that's a yeah, really put your small fingers bird. Fingers around its neck and squeeze. That's a very. It's a baby bird. I mean, that's not just a baby. That's like a hatchling. It's a tiny baby bird. Look at it. And look at how sad he is. Yeah, what, what do you think? He's being helped by this monstrous fish person. <laughs> He's just like... Mm, yes, dinner! See the soul leaving his eyes. You know, that's not oil on the on the bird. That's barbecue sauce. <laughs> mm. Step five. Get involved in marine life protection. A true mermaid would be concerned at the destruction of her habitat. Well, yeah... Human beings should be concerned too. Yeah, <laughs> yeah. Then again, I don't live highly... there. I don't care. Then again, we're a highly self-destructive species. That's true. Join an environmental protection club or a pollution awareness campaign. Research the dangers of overfishing and oil spills. If you live near a beach, take part in cleanup projects. Once again, WikiHow encourages people to do good things for the worst possible reasons. <laughs> <laughs> I mean, the only yeah. way it could be a worse reason is is, is if you were like, you know, uh, you should you should work for the uh, you should you should work to stop pollution because I don't know you think that uh, that car company CEOs should rot in hell, and I'm like, well, that's maybe the worst possible reason. Or maybe no. like you work to stop pollution because I don't know you you're really into acting like. I don't know dragons and dragons are in the air and right. you don't want and they don't you don't want the them polluted. to be suffocating on CO2. Yeah. Mm. Yeah. 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 Or right. even better, you you really like dragons and you think people should ride dragons instead of cars. <laughs> <laughs> don't go overboard with this and lecture everyone about keeping marine life and the sea safe. No. Otherwise, don't go overboard oh, with the singing and the makeup and the fucking accessories. Ma- this is the one thing you might want to get overboard about. <laughs> this has an actual positive effect on the world. Otherwise, people will find you annoying and think that you're only trying to get attention. To and save the sa- fucking planet. To which I then say, if this is actually really important to you, fuck those people and do what you think is important. My God. Like, <laughs> Like if Recycle, you're really into take this, care of the environment. Good. You know, let people know. Care about... Yes, care. Caring is good. And Let's if they care don't care, things. make them care. Explain to them why they should care. Fuck and the mermaid still... part. <laughs> uh, well, uh, we're, we're not quite there yet. I well, mean, now part you, four is... You can, yeah, you can do your research. You can You can look like it. You can act like it. But, you know... It's all about what's in your heart. Yeah, yeah. Feeling. You, you, you like get to this point, and you're like, you know, I I sat down, I read all those books, I watched all those movies, and I bought all those hair extensions and extra clothes and yeah, shampoos dyed my and all face that shit, and, and slammed my face against work, the perfume. And, the... and I've been, you know, I've been, I've been, I've been, you know, volunteering and putting in all my hours towards, you know, helping out at the beach and also, you know, acting. Kind of like a mermaid, but I'm just not feeling it. Okay. Yeah, I'm just not feeling you know? like a mermaid. It was just like an experiment, you know. But I'm done. Yeah. Peace. I'm out. Bye. Well, for that there is part four. Part four. Feeling like a mermaid. S- step one of feeling like a mermaid: keep a diary on your mermaid life. Write down your experiences living underwater, transforming, and the trials of keeping your secret. You can choose uh, to keep this book for yourself, or take it to school and let others guess at its contents. Uh. Uh, you know what? I, I I was walking around with a lot of like books and stuff at school, and people usually didn't really wonder about the contents, because usually they you know assumed schoolwork. Yeah. Uh, I mean, I was a pretty. I, was I mean, a pretty this, big... I mean this this kind of signs this this sounds more like write mermaid fiction. 
See, I was a pretty, I was a pretty lose, uh, pretty, pretty stupid looking loser at school, and I had, uh, I had my phone wallet keys. Uh, a bunch of pens and pencils in one pocket, and 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 the wallet keys and stuff in in the other pocket. And then I'd have, uh, I was wearing cargo pants basically every day. Um, and so I'd have the book we were reading for English class in one pocket, and a graphing calculator in the other one, just in case I needed a calculator, which was more often than you'd think. And uh, y- you know, I think nobody at like after they saw me walking down the hall the first time, nobody stopped me to ask what book I had. So if I had like a diary with me that had full was full of my made up experiences, nobody would ask any questions. They'd just go, "Hey, look at that loser." Okay, let's move on. Is one of the disclaimers of this step gonna be like? I don't know, don't write in it too much, otherwise people will find you annoying and think you're only trying to get attention. You know what, they're well, right. Because well, let's, let's, that's been a very common uh, thing to watch out for. Uh, let's well, find out. If you do choose if, to take a diary, uh, your diary to school, be pr- very protective of, blah, blah, be very protective about it and always have it with you in your sight. This will enhance the mystery and make people wonder what is in your diary. No, it won't. No one gives a shit about you. You're 12 and no one cares about you. <laughs> yeah. whoa, Not whoa, even whoa, your parents. Bob, 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 I was, oh, oh, Bob calm down. Oh. Calm down. If the students are oh. desperate enough, they might try to steal it and peek inside. So you must keep it with you at all costs, unless your plan is to let them see it. However, this isn't recommended, as the other students might tease you about this, and this could ruin your mermaid life. And your real life! It could ruin <laughs> your real life! Oh, the problems oh. of being too good at acting like a mermaid at no. school. No! <laughs> no! Mermaid bigotry oh, strikes no. again! I wanted the, some attention, but not this much. Oh, no! I didn't want this type of attention either. I wanted to be, I wanted to be just like my favorite TV show, H2O, just out of water. <laughs> oh. Yeah, yeah. Oh, boy. Step two. Falling of... Falling feeling. down into the darkness. Oh yeah. yeah, that I like that. That's my favorite part of any process. Yeah. Practice visualization exercises. Before you go to sleep, try imagining yourself as a mermaid in the ocean. Listen for the sound of the waves. You won't. Picture yourself surrounded by schools of fish or running your hands over a cluster of coral. Yeah, like, Feel your body swaying in the pull of the tides. Uh, uh, These exercises will spill over into your dreams. Don't be surprised if you wake up feeling like you've just been for a long swim. My god, uh, maybe I am a mermaid. My bed is all wet. <laughs> <laughs> uh, I oh. just gotta ask, has anyone ever gone on a boat ride and then just later in the day or sometime when you're lying down to bed suddenly feel like you're like falling down a wave and, you know... Has this just happened to like you? Fucking, yeah, yeah, like, you know, when you're rocking up and down with the tide, and then sometime later you'll just feel that again for like a split second. Well, I mean, it's so weird. It is a well-known, it is a well-known phenomenon uh, where people will be falling asleep, and then suddenly they'll have the sensation that their their body is falling. I know, have that quite backwards. often. I, I have yeah, that I've had it happen actually. a couple times, but it might be related to that. Like, your body's so oh, used to no, being no, at like, sea... At that point. Either way, I probably wouldn't want to invoke that. Yeah, it's not a pleasant experience. It's it's a pretty shitty feeling. Yeah. 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 Anyway, step three. Go to the sea. Yeah, look at that (laughs) girl. She she went all the way to the sea so that she could go look at the sand. Yeah, Yeah. she's she's looking (laughs) away from the ocean. She doesn't want to get wet because she doesn't want to reveal she's a mermaid, so... (laughs) Then why is she at the beach in the first place? So she could take a swag selfie. <laughs> oh. Look at that. Yeah, go okay. to the sea. Visit the sea whenever you can and swim in it. Never mind. Yep. Mm. Act like you are at home, and if you do feel at home, this should be easy for you. Oh. Ling- Unless linger you drown. In the water for- <laughs> linger in the water for as long as you can and run your hands through it to show how much you love it. Wow. Oh, man. Love wait, me. wait. So oh. is the is the alternative? Oh. I'm a this human being. I nice go to the water thing. and I go, Ugh, I hate this water. <laughs> Ugh, run this your hands sucks. down the sensual curves of that water. Of, you know, down the sensual curves of those waves. Shit, they're getting away from me. <laughs> curves <laughs> of current. Yeah. <laughs> That's another indie band name. Uh... When you have to leave, reluctantly pull away. But don't delay for too long, or you could become annoying. Can we get a counter for how many times they tell you not to be annoying? (laughs) 
It's quite often by this point. Yeah. If you live near the beach and you are allowed to visit it whenever you please, go visit it whenever you can. The more often you hang out at it, the more likely people will think that you are true that you truly are a mermaid. Or maybe or that just... you just like to go to the beach. Yeah. 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 That makes yeah. way more sense actually. Wow. Yeah. yeah. Oh, Can't believe I didn't think beach. of that. She likes going to the beach a lot. Is she a mermaid? No, what am I thinking? That's stupid. Yeah. <laughs> she once confided in me that she'd all she's always wanted to fuck a fish. Is she a mermaid? <laughs> No, she's just really fucked up. Yeah. Oh, that's what it is. She's what you might you, call a. Uh, well, not. I guess Scaly's already taken. <laughs> Gilly? Well, Fishy. well, Fishy. when they are, what well, you know, when people a finny. want to. Oh my god. Yeah. Nice. Actually, you know what? No. I bet they already have a term. I'll go look it up. Yeah. Uh, no, you don't. Furries. Later, maybe. No. For fish. Okay, oh whatever. my god. If you don't live anywhere near the beach, visit the pool and swim in it as much as you can. Avoid swimming in the pool when people, stranger, are straight. Avoid, avoid swimming in the pool when people, stranger or friends, are around and immediately leave. If you have no option but to swim with others, wear your charm in the pool with you. Only do this if it is sterling silver, as it will not discolor or rust. Oh wow! Well. Oh well, now we have finally an explanation for sterling silver. What if it's uh, you know, what if it's that uh... explanation wasn't even that long? Why couldn't you just put it up above? Well, because eh. the, 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 what what did it say? Like, if you are confused, it will be explained later. That is literally as long an expl- as long as the explanation was. Hmm. Whatever. When you're alone in the pool, practice swimming like a mermaid. Then show off your moves at the beach whenever you can visit it. But don't show off your moves at the pool, because that's weird. So according yeah. to WikiFur... And, dot- and people will think that you are just trying to look for attention. According to WikiFur.com, dragons and lizards... Uh, people who are in, you know, into dragons and lizards are scalies. Uh, people who are into mm-hmm. dolphins and orcas are cetaceans. Birds and griffins are featheries or avians. And centaurs being just called tars, but there's not a word for fish, fish people. Oh, dude we're, dude, we're breaking into a new market here. Finnies, yeah. or I suggest either finnies or uh, fish fuckers. <laughs> I mean, maybe that one's a little on the nose. <laughs> maybe. Yeah. You know, might, might be. Sorry, might. I just had to, I had to go check. Okay. Right. Well, and while now I have to checked, blast my cash. While we've yeah. checked, while we've che- while, while you've checked, we have reached part five. Yes. Keeping it in perspective. Yes. Very important. This. Yeah. Hey, she got her. Uh, she got her hand removed. Yeah. From from her shoulder. Yeah. <laughs> and she has nice. a nice. she has a nice new earring. Yeah. 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 Step one. Don't go overboard. Okay. Thanks You're, for uh, saying that again. A little late, but okay. Yeah. Keeping it. Well, real. I mean, they they've kept saying it because you know. Anyway, if you, drop, if you drop, if you drop, goddamn, if you drop too many hints or act too self-important, people will start to get irritated. Mm, the point of this yep. is to become a mermaid, not to alienate your friends. Unless they just yep. really want to fuck up, kill, fucking kill mermaids. <laughs> Yeah. Try, try sticking to a few subtle hints and some basic costuming every day instead of going for the full effect all the time. Hey, here's a, here's an idea. <laughs> Why don't you get a couple striped bass, right? And <laughs> hear me out. Get a couple striped bass, rub them all over yourself to get the smell, and then like a few days later, stick them into your pant legs so that they kind of stick out a little bit next to your, next to your shoes. Oh, okay. Like the fins. Uh. Right, and the people no, will be like, "Hey, is that a fin? Is that a fin I see down there? Oh. Why do I smell do fish? Fi- do you have fish in your pants? No, I don't have fish in my pants." And then you like, you know, you like try to cover it up, <laughs> and then you okay. just look at them and give them the old two eye wink, whatever. Wink. And finally, finally, the final step, oh, part uh, five, step two. She's she looks different now. Whatever. Uh, have fun with your double life. 
If you start to feel bored or uncomfortable in your role, then maybe it's time to take a break from being a human and just be a mermaid. Yeah, all mermaid. Just yeah. be a fish. Yeah, <laughs> fuck being a human at all. Uh, remember that being a mermaid is about having fun. You're living in two worlds now, but don't let it become a chore. This is for your enjoyment only. Okay. Uh, okay. Can I can I go back to the picture for a second? Yeah, sure. Everything sure. looks fine, right? Mm-hmm. I mean, she mm-hmm. looks different. Her proportions seem different, and her nose seems bigger. But yeah. then look at, like, her chest. Like, All right. Doesn't that it, look okay. really bony to you? It, it Okay. I think it kind of looks like she has a she has huge collar collar yeah, bones. like the collarbones just look massive, and like then there's her, nothing her col- yeah. her her collarbone like her collarbone goes to like halfway her breast like I roughly, think it's suppo- like that I think those are supposed to be breasticles, but they don't <laughs> look like breasts <laughs> it just looks like she has giant collarbones yeah that's a little weird. Yeah, that is the that is really weird. Yeah, really weird. All right, mm. so let's let's go to the community Q and A. Let's see yeah. what do we have here. <clears throat> On what websites can I find the quiz to see what kind of mermaid I am? <laughs> okay, <laughs> that's a stupid question. Actually, there's a <laughs> lot of questions, so let's just focus on one or two. Yeah. Well, ac- we we well actually she may. Mm, I mean, there's also some tips and some warnings. Yeah, we'll have to go through those. Uh, what if my friend says I'm faking it and tells the whole school? <laughs> a real friend will understand when you are interested in something. If you asked her not to tell anyone and she still did, then she's not your friend. Let her go and search out healthier friendships. No. Bullshit. A real friend will tell you when you're wrong. <laughs> a real friend will go, hey, you're being a real idiot right now. And I'm trying to correct you so you don't make a fool of yourself in front of the rest of the school. Yeah. <laughs> will people think I am a mermaid or will they think I am a baby? Oh, man. Can... <laughs> uh, hey, can I be a scene and can I be seen and half mermaid at the same time with my hair at medium? Wow, I made a joke earlier about a scenester mermaid, <laughs> yeah. but. Uh... Uh, how do you act like a mermaid in winter? What if they do? A- what if they ask to see me do magic, but I don't really have any? <laughs> oh God, the answer is also pretty great. Say that the mermaid child conspiracy prevents you from doing it in public, or simply that you are forbidden to project- practice magic in front of humans. <laughs> People find uh, by that, that point you're in way too deep. Also, Ba-doom-tsh. would it be okay if I don't dye my hair? Also, do I have to wear ocean colors? So you're, there were like two major tips in looking like a mermaid, and they were uh, wearing ocean colors and don't and dyeing your hair. So if you don't do either well, no, of those things, that's yeah. just accessorize. Yeah. Okay. Well, I mean, be yourself and embrace yourself as a unique mermaid. Ask a question. Why would? <laughs> You want to be a goddamn mermaid. <laughs> uh, and while we wait for it... Right there, I'll just <laughs> fill this in. I don't care. While we wait for an answer, we have some tips here. Oh, on, yeah. on oh we have mermaid. a lot of tips, actually. There's Jeez. a lot of tips here. There's even showing more tips. Holy crap. Yeah. Uh, so I guess... <laughs> I'm looking at these. These are great. When people talk about mermaids, act secretive and smile to yourself. If they insult mermaids, frown and turn away quietly, acting wounded. Uh, you oh, say, you're here's... like, man, fuck mermaids. And I'm like, damn. Damn. <laughs> damn. Oh, here's Where's the damn fourth coral? Here's an answer to something we asked earlier. Try adding salt water to your hair after you shampoo. It makes your hair look like you were just at the pool or beach. You can also buy a salt spray that is sold at many stores worldwide. What? If someone asks you why your hair is wet, just smile and change the subject. Hey, Connor, what? why is your hair wet? Uh, <laughs> um, uh, well, let's continue. It's a beautiful day out today, right? <laughs> uh, I asked you a question. <laughs> Oh man, you know I'm I'm super excited for later. You know there's going to be another episode of Walking Dead, and I'm, you know I, I've heard I've heard they get up into some wacky shenanigans, uh, you know, and all that. If anybody asks you if you are a mermaid, look as if you are trying to come up with an answer. Then look flustered and a bit nervous as you say, "Well, what makes you say that?" 
Oh, you think I'm a mermaid? Yeah. Oh. Yeah. I can't believe oh, you would think such a down, crazy thing about me. Later down, there's a different tip that says if anyone asks if you are a mermaid, just laugh and deny it. Like, nah, or haha, mermaids aren't real silly, and toss your hair. <laughs> Do not deny it too much, or people might think you are not a mermaid. <laughs> what? <laughs> no. God. Fuck. We can't have that, can we? Oh. How about this? That uh, one, how about this? That, uh, one re- that one really just made me kind of angry. <laughs> If you do have money to burn, you can order a mermaid tail for your own use. It, you won't be able to wear it at school, but it will certainly help you get into character. <laughs> yeah. And I really like I really like this. Feeling a little sick? If anyone asks, yeah, say like you feel one. seasick. If someone laughs, Pretty look much. confused and rush away. You know, actually, guys, yeah. speaking of sick, I was throwing up yesterday, but I'm feeling a lot better today. Uh, I'm not well, feeling very... Well, Seasick. <laughs> That's a nice joke, you yeah. know, implying that you've been at the ocean or uh, such. Yeah, uh, hmm. yeah okay. Uh, see, see, see. Anyway, warnings. War- oh, dude, always practice safe swimming procedures. <laughs> <Okay>. Yeah. <laughs> You know, if you drown, people will know you're not a mermaid. Yeah, people will be like, hey, hang on. You Wait drowned. You're dead right now. And then uh, your social something. life will be ruined. Uh, oh, something oh, doesn't also, add up. Also, your actual life will be over. Your <laughs> yeah. life will be forfeit. You could say that something is fishy about this situation. But oh, tr- snap. And make sure your mermaid outfits don't con- conflict with the school dress code. Yeah, we, we, we already sort of covered that partially. Earlier wow. in one of the steps. Yeah. The related wiki house, there's more stuff than I thought for being like a mermaid. Well, yeah. I guess this article is the one official all inclusive one. Yeah, and I see I, how I to guess. pretend to have ice powers down there, so. Oh, God, yeah. do you guys see how to do stage makeup on kids? Look at that fucking picture. Oh, um, my God, no. That's a nightmare. How? How to look like you are on drugs? Why would you want to look like you're on drugs? In case you're going for an you know an interview, uh, at a, <laughs> that you really don't want job, to and you get. really don't want to get the job. You're like, oh my my resume is perfect, but I don't want this job. What why do I, I do? Why you did, look like you're on why, drugs. Why did I even send them my resume? Yeah. <laughs> Ugh. They're like, well, well we really your mom, liked your interview. Your, and your mom like, sent on. out your resume to, you know, ten people oh. a day. Yeah. Oh, shit. Well, there oh, you go. Man. That was how to act like a mermaid at school. At school. At school. All right, this was supposed to be at school. I keep forgetting. Yeah, well, now you know. Now I know. And uh, Knowledge is power. Yeah, knowledge is, is, I mean, water power. Thank you, yeah, Eternal oh. Flame, for suggesting it. Sorry it took so long for us to get to it, but we got there. Here you are, buddy. Yeah. Yeah. And if you guys, if any of you watching have any suggestions of your own, feel free to leave them in the comments below or email them to us or tweet us or whatever. It doesn't really matter. Just get a hold yeah. of us yeah. somehow. Yeah. You, you, you figure it out. You're a smart person. Yeah. Yeah. You're not trying to be a mermaid at school. Let's, yeah. <laughs> You're a smart person. You're smart enough to I not said. do that. You smart. You loyal. <gasps> <laughs> turns out I was DJ Khaled all along. Oh my god. Oh no. Opa Gangnam style. Yeah. <laughs> Memes. <laughs> Memes. Alright. Thanks for watching. Yeah. Good night.